I want to talk about trucks. I've heard a lot of contractors say you can't run your business with anything but an F-250, 350, 550. I've been running my business with an F-150. I've had a gas guzzling F-250. I've ran my business with a Dodge Dakota. And that's what I want to talk about in this video. Can you run a landscaping business with an F-150? I've been this whole time. In fact, why would you get a bigger truck for something if you actually don't even need it? I'm talking about efficiency. Let me know in the comments below what kind of truck you run your business with. Let's go. I actually do the bare minimum when it comes to maintenance, but I do do things that are extremely important like not letting the motor in my truck blow up because I've blown up the motor in a truck by abusing it and it was an old F-150 with 250,000 miles. With my piece of shit uh, Dakota that I do landscaping in, check this out. The hood flew up while I was driving. I'm just going to be totally honest, right behind me is the F-350 and this has got to be new. We're gonna oil change in a tire rotation on my truck right now, and I'm looking at these. You say, I see it all the time, all over YouTube. Oh, you absolutely, you gotta have a 250 or a 350. It's gotta be a four by four. Of course, if you're plowing snow, but uh, uh, uh. Dude, I plowed snow for five years with an F-150. Commercial properties, hundreds of thousands of square feet in entire parking lots plowing snow. I mean, we beat up the front end. We had to rebuild the whole front end on the truck, but what I'm talking about is you gotta do what you gotta do to get to where you gotta get. Look at this little Ranger truck. This is probably a little four cylinder. I know for a fact it is. I imagine I started my business with a truck called the Blue Goose. It was an old 1992, rust all over it, Dodge Dakota, two wheel drive. Bro, I pulled a trailer with that thing. I beat on it, drove all over cities, built the whole landscape business. I loved the Dakota so much. I'm like, I just wanna use Dakotas because that's all I could afford. And then I got a slightly newer Dakota. It was a 2001 with rust all over it. Dude, that thing was a champ. You could literally build a whole landscaping business with this. You don't have to jump right to the 250 or the 350 or a brand new truck. But what I'm saying, imagine this being an old truck. It, it just, it's whatever works, works. Of course, you're not going to go tow a 14 foot dump trailer or a 20 foot box trailer with mowers with that. It won't even work, but you can definitely tow an open face trailer with a walk behind push mower, hand tools, anything that you need right behind this. So what kind of truck do you need? Can you run a business with the F-150? Absolutely. Let's look at some F-150. I love this. This one is dope. Look at this F-250 Tremor. What's this truck? Got to be $70,000. What's your payment on that if you buy it? I lease my F-150. I love it. I'm at the dealership right now. All I gotta do is just drop it off. No maintenance, nothing. And then when the lease is up, I go get another brand new truck. And the lease payment is low. Cash flow out of the business pays for it. And all the miles are right off. So why wouldn't I do that, right? Something like this, you're looking at literally $1,200 a month in a truck payment. I don't know if you're in a seasonal business or not, or if you plow snow, but unless you plow snow, I go with the F-150 lease. If you get a brand new truck at the dealership that's an F-250 or up, you can't lease it. They won't lease them to you. You can only buy them. Man, I'm in a dream right now. I've always loved Ford trucks because I always had a broken Ford truck. I always had the biggest piece of crap on the road. So this, this is a dream come true to me to have a new Ford truck. Can you run your business with the F-150? If it suits your business, absolutely yes. You could pull a whole box trailer with the F-150, man. These have got upgraded suspensions. And if you got an older F-150, fine. Take it to the spring shop and get extra leaf springs added into the back. Done. So really it's all about what works best for your business. Of course you can run a landscape business with the F-150. Unless you're hauling around huge commercial equipment, I mean, do what works best for you. For now, I'm keeping the F-150. I really like that 250 though, but we'll see.